You could look at air hockey as the culmination of centuries of Western technology, the Industrial Revolution, discovery of electricity, industrial blowers, rosins and plastics from petroleum, extrusion of aluminum, steel from iron ore, formica. You know, all these things that came about through the Industrial Revolution culminated in air hockey in 1972. We always assumed that some one person conceived of this game, sat down and invented it. It didn't happen that way. The credit for really inventing air hockey as we know it is in dispute. There's a lot of mystery. Nobody's sure who invented air hockey, what, is what I believe. Well, the origins of air hockey were revealed to us in many, many mysterious ways. There were people working for uh, NASA. They were working on a prototype for hovercraft. So they used air cushion tables. That has this frictionless surface. Frictionless motion. A frictionless air environment. They had these puck-shaped things floating on the table. One of the inventors threw the disc down through the other end and said, I win. I win. I win. You're buying coffee this morning. One of the other inventors grabbed a, an eraser. Somebody said, oh, I have to let me defend myself. And he grabbed two erasers. So then they started hitting the disc with the eraser. And uh, their boss walked down and caught him and, and says, what are you guys doing? And the other guy said, um, well, we're playing air hockey. Uh, well, we're playing air hockey. Uh, we're, 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 we're playing uh, air hockey. And there was no question that that was the truth. 